here it is. The 700 Tater. This is eight foot by two, and it's exactly what I've been looking for. Well, as you know, I have been on the search for a plunge pool. I have been looking for one of these galvanized babies. This is eight foot. It's made by Tater, and I have been looking for months. After the pandemic, everybody uh, sold out because everybody was using it as a pool. So what happened was because of COVID, these um, the manufacturing tater, they actually had to close down is what I was told by several stores that they had to close down and they weren't in production and then they came back into production, but everybody had been selling out as soon as they got it. Well, my sweet neighbor just called me. I was in the middle of a Netflix binge watch on the Sunday afternoon and she says they have two at the local Sutherlands. I jumped up so fast and grabbed my phone. I called up here. They said, yes, we have two. They're this much, they're this big. I said, can you please hold it? They said, no, since it's such a like high demand item, I can't hold it. I said, okay, I'm gonna be there in like 20 minutes. We jumped up out of bed. We grabbed the trailer, we hooked it up and we busted butt to get up here and they had it. I ran right inside. I had Jeremy drop me off at the door, not even park. And I ran inside and I was like, I wanna pay for one of those out there right now. So paid for it, came out and now they are hooking it up, strapping it in, and I'm one happy mama. We have a plunge pool. Yep. Strap it down, yes. Yes. Got strap. Well, we're going back roads, gravel roads and stuff, so I think I'm gonna do two, just to make sure. So super excited. Okay, so we're not going straight home yet. We are going to enjoy some snow cones. I have not had this place in a long time. Jeremy used to come here when I was pregnant with the kids and they are like 13 and 11 now. They have the best snow cones ever. It's called Josh's Snow Shack and there used to be one in Broken Arrow. I'm pretty sure it's still there, but uh, we live about an hour away from there now. So I'm very excited to see this here. So we are gonna go get our favorite silver fox and this is the only place we can get it. There it is, the silver fox and it is wonderful. It tastes good, as good as you can remember. Yeah. So I'm gonna tell you what is in the Silver Fox. It is vanilla and coconut. That's it, vanilla and coconut. And they have the best ice at Josh's. Mmm, it's so good. They fill it up with so much. Boy, have I missed this. All right, ready to go home and set up our pool? Now the fun begins. Not on the grass, not on the grass. Oh my God, he's on the grass. Well, it's time to get our new pool out of the trailer and is going to go right here. So just to get a better look. So I'm gonna put it right here and I'm gonna slowly style it up just a little bit um, so it looks like it was supposed to be there and just make it a little bit like tighter and nicer instead of just a stock tank sitting there. So maybe some lights for the ambiance, maybe some um, decorations, I don't know. We'll go figure it out once we get it in. Right now we're just sweating and we just want the pool to work. Yours. Yours. So it don't roll. Once you get on that side, it's going 
All right, go. Right there. You want it there or do it go in a little bit? It starts going up that field right here. It's okay. See? Okay, try further in that way towards the fence. Can you get in the way of the gate? Okay, what about more over to the fence and then further in towards me? Over? I don't care what you told me. Bring it in this way. I just want to see. That's where I pictured it, right there. Okay, now it's going downhill. Okay. Follow me? Yes. So put it where you like. Where you okay. think it needs to go. Move all this out of the way. No, it's not going here. It's not happening. No, no, no. Go ahead. Put it where you think you need it. Right. So it needs to be. Why do you keep pulling it so far? I don't want it all the way out there. Filling up the pool? Mm hmm I got it all cleaned out. Now we're getting ready to start. We're filling it up now. So you rinsed it? Yeah, I rinsed it out. Got all the bird poop and the dust out. And then now there's little pieces of grass in it. Better come out. Do you know how many gallons this is? Like 700. Yep, gallons. 700 gallons. Well, it's evening out more on that yep. side because before it was only like from yeah, here to here good. and it was only here. Now I it's... Maybe we should go a little tad bit more over here to this side. I would say... Not, no, because mom's wanting to put stuff well, like around it. Well, like a tad, like a little... Well, I'm wanting to put some rock and yeah, stuff around that's it. that's good. Well, okay, that's like right there? Yeah. Let's see how much room we have. Right now the water is evening out. Yeah, so that's yeah. more level, guys. Yeah. Okay. Perfect though. So do you want, let me ask you this, do you want that drain? We need to, we need to, I think we need to rotate it. Oh, the drain and go here. well here's you know the saying? drain. Unless you and put, here's the Unless you seam. plan on putting the, the inlet and outlet by the drain. Where do you want? Remember, we need to change the hoses. Yes, but which way does this need to be so be Due to this, we can't put it up here, so we're going to put, you know, the in the outlet in this area, and then the inlet maybe down here, or do we want to put a bolt in this section, just in different areas? We don't know. We don't know. But for now, we have the return and then the inlet piece. They do need the holes drilled. We cannot find the pieces. fitting because this is kind of impossible right now to find stuff that fits anything for a pool or for pool fittings or for pool filters because they come from China and we're not getting much right now because of the bid and this is what we're going to have to deal with. I'm going to have to just, I used a water pump thing to hold it down and I've got the water like this to try to cool down the temperature. We are still filling it up. We're not going to drill any holes yet until we can get the proper fittings for the ends of the two returns. 
I'm sorry, that return and the two inputs or inlets or whatever you want to call them. And then we'll drill the holes and put them where they need to go. But for now, we're just going to do it like this. Let the kids swim. And then in the next couple days, I'm going to come back around, do some landscaping and make it look nice and make it kind of look resorty and beachy and tropical the way it should look. You know, bury some electrical cord, get rid of the hose, all that fun stuff. And you know, when you swim and you get so cold, then you've got to wear a snuggie in the middle of July because, you know, it's cold. Right, right. Thank you so much for going on today's adventure. This is pretty exciting for the whole family. If you like our content, please subscribe. And please join us for our next video. Hope you have a great day. Bye.